Hey everybody, Metal Gamer Geek here. Welcome to another episode of Let's Play Above Snakes. I think we left off where I need to research and place a lumberjack cabin question mark. Let's see. Oh yeah, I built this. My little tin smelter. Which I don't think I have any on me. I have to go to the river for that. Or the lake. Yeah, I have tin ore, but not anything there. Why don't we just put everything back? Transfer stack. Or no, we want to make some arrows. So we need to... How do we make arrows again? Flint and a, br a branch, not lumber. Branch... That back. I think that's enough to make flint, right? Uh, do, 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 do. Where's, the, where's the handcrafting part? Her bench? Handcrafted. Flint. There we go. Here, let's make. I guess I'll make three. And I have a ton of arrows for when I finally get this. When I finally get this. Uh, drawstring bow. Or drawstring, basically. Alright, so I have, the, I have everything, I think. Oh, I can only have stacks of 30. Okay, so I'm, I'm taking up way too much inventory with all of my arrows. All right, let's look at the map. I have the world. Looks kind of nice. Not gonna lie. Um, I'm starving. It's always the thing. Consumables, 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 consumables. Fifty. I could do. What's the best food I could make right now? Let's see. I have no branches. No branches. I also noticed that whatever station I'm near. Did it say anything there? No. What was the little tannery symbol there for then? Huh. New recipe for three fish. Grilled fish. Ooh, that's good. What if I do fish, honey, honey? Fish, fish, honey? No. Fish, mushroom, water? Fish, water, fish. Fish, water, water. Fish, water, carrot. Fish, water, honey. Fish, water, vanilla. Vanilla, fish, fish. Nope, I don't know anything else. Okay, so... I guess the best thing to do would be just to drink some water. Eat some... Berry bowls. Yeah, that's good. Okay. We need... Do I have the research done for uh, the next piece? Cartography table? Tell me where we are. I need to get four rocks and two cotton. That's right. I need to get cotton so I can make my, my new uh, piece right here. Three fabric. And to make fabric, I need two cotton. So I need six cotton. It's at least seven cotton. Which has me running all the way up here. To the planes because I put it so far away. <laughs> and it's noon. It'd be really great if I could, uh. Get my bow and arrow soon. I have a feeling it's gonna be something to do with that log cabin I have to place. Because it seems like everything is tile progression based or gated. 
which is okay. I'm just used to other games, I guess, having a different kind of progression or a gated, gated progression kind of way. Like Valheim, it's gated by your boss fights. Same thing in V Rising. All right, here we go. Hemp. I think this is the cotton plant over here. Yeah. Hemp plant. Hemp plant. So much hemp. If we put down another planes piece. Yeah, that's what we need. Cotton plants. How many do I have now? I probably have resources. Three. I need uh, four more at least. Carrots. Int. I still haven't figured out. No, mint is what helps restore fatigue. When I make one of those uh, just random food bowls. Oh, cotton really isn't all that plentiful. This is, though, there's zombies there, so I can get teeth to make my necklace. I know I need four rocks, which I think I have now after I find this. Hey, zombie. Give me your teeth. Yes. Quickly, 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 loot him. A book. Where do these zombies have books? I'm gonna get you, rabbit. So from the rabbits, you only get one piece of meat, which makes sense because they're tiny. There's your cotton. What are the, uh, these? They're just random flowers in the field? Yep. This one did not yield as much cotton as I would have liked. I will pick this one clean. And now we run back to uh, home. Can I place a new tile to make it a quicker journey? Yes. That are used dipping. Was it this one is for fatigue sanity? I need the mushroom bowl. I think my health regens over time, right? Lacking nothing, you feel well. So you're lacking nothing. That makes me feel like either I can get a status like debuff. Or maybe if I don't eat after a while, I'll become malnourished or something. I don't know. I'll we'll have to figure it out. Oh, don't go too hard with the runs. The runnings. All right, now we're at the tannery. I can make one, two, three.
And then I could make you. Still can't do anything here, but now we can go to the cartography table. Let's go just take this first. I think I want to just test something. Does it take like a 24, like a certain amount of time in game to reset? Or is it like the next day cycle? So no beeswax is important. Let's go in here. Research this. Lumberjack cabin is in the woods. That makes sense. So I could actually place that now if I wanted to. And I kind of do. Let's put them right there. Boom. Let's see now, though. Uh, equipment. Robe. Enhanced robe. Equip. So, could I sell this? If I trash it... No, I can't sell it. It has no resell value. Trash item. Okay. Let's put stuff in the chest. But you could just transfer everything. Okay. Go to bed. So now we have to make our way to the hunter's cabin. Or the lumberjack cabin. Before I do that, I have enough on the hunger meter just to keep doing this. The roll doesn't really increase your speed anywhere. So each of these coasts or these shores There's no criticals on that one, that's why. Okay, let me try uh fishing rod. Not scoop water, fishing rod. Stamen. I want to see if it's just... You get two uses per fishing spot, right? Bluegill. I want more weird scrap. Does more stuff show up in these boxes over time? No. They're a one and done. Okay. I was thinking of just making this lake... A circ a tiny little circle. But now that I know that's where tin comes from, I might just make it like this big. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, so let's now go to the log cabin. After we fish this spot. And maybe get some more water. Fish. I wonder if it's only in the first usage of the spot you get the scrap. Urgent? Catch us? That's an achievement? Okay. Bluegill again. You haven't caught any scrap. Okay, let's go. One quick thing I want to check out though, before we go, workbench buffs, uh, melee damage, yes. should eat. Um, bowl of berries. Hunger. Hunger. Thirst. We're all good. I know I put 
put them all the way up there. Rabbits are a tough one. Yeah, deer are a lot easier. Until I get my bow. And they yield three pieces. Usually hide. Um, maybe double meat. Oh, hide, antler, and meat. We are going the correct way. Also, let's place... Pretty big forest biome. Ooh, a zombo. That actually hurt. Give me your tooth. Or your bones. One way or another, I'm getting something out of you. Ooh, a storage chest? Can I just take whatever's in here? Rocks. Alex rocks. taking all this stuff. Hey, friend. Let me search your... Try <laughs> not to be rude or anything. I'm just gonna take all your stuff first. Uh, oh, you have a bow. This probably is where I get the bow, then. Stark. Hmm. Hello there. Pleased to meet you. I'm Stark, and this is my simple home. The woods were such a nice, safe place before the lost souls began roaming around here. Such a shame. Luckily for me, I don't live in Corpse Creek. Why are you alone? Lonely not at all, and I don't live alone by any means. Bass is my best friend and a good boy. Where is he? Uh, is that your dog outside? I didn't see a dog outside, did I? Oh, there he is. That's a big old doggo. Oh, I see you've met Bass already. I don't know what I would do without him. He's my loyal companion and best friend. He's harmless, and he does everything for some belly rubs. Continues laughing. Okay. Why are you worried about the people that used to live in Corpse Creek? What's going on there? Oh, do I? Uh, well, apparently, these woods were such a nice, safe place before the Lost Souls began roaming around here. Such a shame. I've heard dreadful things about that night. Say, so, can you do me a favor? I'll explain a little later. It would make... Uh... It would be feeling a lot better. What's your favor? Glad to hear. I'm planning to make something, but I require a skull of a big animal. It has to be of some size. Understood? Uh, find the skull of a dead animal at a glade? Oh. Hmm. Oh, so I can't even finish talking to you. I'm glad I stole all your stuff. Let's go see if we can give the, the doggo a belly rub. Woof woof. Look at collar. Let's see. What is the name put on your say bass? Apparently, your name bass. Rub his belly. Woof woof. All right, bye bass. All right, so I need to go back and research the glade tile. But along the way, let's make it so that I can plant it or place it as soon as possible. There we go. Get some more mushrooms, because that's actually a pretty good recipe. It's the way back. The way back is... This way. I mean, I guess I could put the glade here. Wherever it starts to show itself. Or what is a glade exactly? We could use more feathers. This is how we get the branches. Lumbers want to chop it down, obviously. Feathers as well. Okay. From what I can see, I get huckleberries. Trees and rocks from the meadows. Trees... 
um, animals and bees from the forest. Here's my cabin. And then cotton, hemp, carrots, and stuff from the plains. Cartography table. Four rocks. I think I have rocks on me over here. Two, three, four. I wish they had a thing craft and storage so much. Every game, every survival game needs to have a craft from storage. Tin nails and scrap. I could make tin nails. Hold on. How many tin nails? Eight tin nails. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I think I need an anvil for that, though. Let's smelt our tin ore. do to make this rocks glass let's make some glass just for whatever reason i feel like we're gonna need it soon monocular you mean a large fresh water i'm gonna sell this guy i'm gonna cook this guy down got those got the commons Sell those guys. Uh, okay, so... I don't think I can make tin nails here, can I? I could make the anvil smelts ingots into tools. Oh. Build an anvil. Where's placement on foundation? I guess we'll place a bookshelf as well. Let's see, we have building, anvil. What if we do it like this? Move the workbench to here. And then move the anvil to like here. That makes sense to me. Now, what do we do with the anvil? We make tin nails. So, ooh, okay, leather strips. We don't have that yet. Shovel? Don't I have a shovel? No, I don't have a shovel. So now I have a shovel. Put you at four. Okay. What else can we make here? So we could replace our axe and our pickaxe with that. I have to make this binocular, two glass and one scrap part. I can actually make that. I have a scrap part in the chest. Make you. Here, just access the cartography table even if you were all, oh, all, oh, one use. So now I have a lost soul necklace equipment. So it puts my gear level to six. Does that mean I'm stronger now? Usually, yes, that's what that means, buddy. Okay. Wait, there's rifles in this game, too. Okay. Enhanced robe. I don't have any leg or head armor. All right, what else did we learn to make? So I have one scrap part still, and I have to make... I have to go f getting more tin tomorrow. Let's see. Oh, you have to research this first. Cartography. Oh, yeah. Four rocks. That's the whole reason I went out there before. That's the whole reason I picked up the rocks. And I'm like, let me just make some glass. Okay. 
I feel like dodge rolling bumps up the uh, stamina for some reason. You know, for some reason. Get my sanity or get my health back. My uh, fatigue, those are the words. One of them words was going to be the right one. Uh, consumables, consumables, consumable. So I have no more mushroom soup. Okay. Look. So I definitely need it. I have no more. Uh, mm. Look some. Let me see if I can cook. You and mint and mint. Meat, meat, mint, meat, carrot. No. Heal is your sanity. your thirst oh a little bit of everything all right uh let's just put Ooh. okay so from now on put three of something down inedible just vanilla you're, you're silly fertilizer we figured that one out Fish skewer. That makes your berry bowl. We kind of want that too. Honey just does that. Makes you super thirsty. Okay, so now let's fix things. Let's go. That's for hunger. That's for that. We want just hunger and a little... Hmm. Let's go to the lake. Get more tin. Also, what's the... Alright, so here's what we're going to do. Oh no, it's not back yet. When is that for charge? I guess I know what I'm doing. I wonder if it's a full 24 hours in game it takes. It's Huckleberry, buddy. Don't take down the Huckleberry bush. side. Scouting, scouting. Well, I know that it wants rocks. I know we also need tin to make my, uh, Improved axe and and pickaxe. So would that mean that it takes less hits to break something down? Or do I yield more on my resources? I can't get to there. 
Good job placing that. Ooh, collect a hundred common rocks. How many rocks can fit in the stack? Right, so we're going to build out this lake area so that I have 10. Get a ton of rocks. Well, I mean, I could do the cartography table thing. I think that's a waste of the item mode. I would need that for like when I'm super far away. Also, am I able to build a base super far away from my main area? So I'm assuming it's going to have me go super far away, right? I would assume. So when I have a weapon out, walk like that. Okay, it's not that I'm crouch walking, it's just that I'm... I don't know what that is. Give me more tin, please. Thank you. Yeah, we're just going on... I should probably be fishing, also. I'll just go on all these for all these rocks. Bluegill. It was only two times you can go to a spot. Bluegills. Can I fish that spot? Yes. Do 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 do. Yeah, two. That was weird that I got three out of that spot. Okay, so the next piece we're going to make has to be you. this down before the night comes. Maybe. Nice. Okay, so let's piece of this lake down and then we'll get our tin and go home nice okay let's get out of here uh, no not no night fishing 24 hours That's what it takes. I think I did these at night. The next time I come back here, when I need tin, they'll all be here. And that's a decent amount of tin now. You should be there too. Okay. Good, and then we'll scoop some waters. Two. Until my fatigue starts to like really take a hit. Okay, 
to run. We gotta get back home. Good thing it's right here. Should be able to pick up the water. Good. No, my backpack is full. Can I not put consumables? Oh, I can. I've just been. Oh, you fool. You big old fool. Alright, so I have to make another storage chest. It has to be placed on a foundation. scrap part if I get if I use this last scrap part for this I can't use it to upgrade my workbench right I'm in a, between a rock and a hard place oh I didn't sleep so that's bad news let's eat food I guess uh sanity's fine that's fine. I think I have steaks somewhere. I thought I had steaks somewhere. Wait a minute. Did I cook meat? And yeah. Okay. Um, I have to. I have to use this. That makes me sad on the inside. Storage uh, to lumber. So let's build another storage. I'll put this one here for food, I guess. Or we expand the base this way. I need to drink water. Can I drop something? Oh, meat screw. That's what happened to it. That's my hunger. Drink before you become dehydrated. Good. All right. So we have to. Oh, man. The mad scramble to, like, get everything done the right way. We're going to go two that way. One on each side. Cook all this water down. Okay. So I need to build one, two, three, four, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 pieces. So, 8 lumber, 9, 10 lumber, 11, 12 lumber for that. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 lumber and 6 plant fiber. I'll just take the stack.
more of those. And then... There we go. That's actually a nice way to do that. Time to move everything. Okay, building time. Break everything down. Do, 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 do. Chop this guy down here. enough iron or tin stuff now so I could make maybe the better weapon. Okay. Uh, resources, equipment, nope, consumables, building. We could rotate, the oh, we could have rotated these the whole time. I could have done like a checker pattern. I'm fine with that. Alright, now eight. Just destroy my bed. Let's go inside here so I don't do that again. Yeah, I destroyed my bed. Cool to know that that's a way to do that. There we go. There's that. So then again, we move. Now we have to go out of the house, so we move this. One more thing that I wish was different was like when you select the hammer, like you keep the hammer selected. You don't have to keep toggling it. That'd be great. I don't know how to count. I need two more. Um, what's this over here? Branch. All right, so I need two more of those pieces. So two. And then my house is complete. Where can I place this? Oh, is it because that's in the way? I could also put that outside. That might make things a lot more easier. So could I put you outside also? It changes everything, kind of, but not really. I want to have I want to have everything inside here. Although a furnace and an anvil should be outside if I think about it. that there put this guy also outside then we do all of our B stuff here I'm gonna space them out a little more yeah space these guys out Five, 
Maybe go 10 in total and then rotate them the other way. Yeah. Or I think the easier way to do it would be these guys to there. So let's move this to here. Can I do it like putting them back to back? Yeah, I can. Is that basically back to back? Yeah. You come here. I mean, it's not perfect, but whatever. All right, I have to rebuild a bed now because I'm going to lose my sanity. Um, so I have a bookcase. Why don't I build a bookcase for it? I think it might help with the shelter level. Yeah, I think it helps with the shelter level. Like, coziness or uh, comfort level kind of thing in most of these survival games. Alright, cartography table is going to go near the bookshelf, obviously. Obviously. Uh, then we're going to have the workbench. Still, I'm getting used to the rotating camera thing. Bench goes here. With the storage. Maybe I put this. Like so. Caddy corner. Yeah. I'm getting way too into this part right now. And you have the fletching table. I probably should start putting like certain boxes near certain things. Can I put a storage outside? Dude, you can. Okay. Here's what we're going to do. Chest near here. Also, build your bed. I think when I destroyed it, I got my resources back. Plant fibers. Hay bed. Is there a better bed for me? No. Hay bed. Hay bed. I need a plant fiber. Let's go with... Hay bed. Also, let's make up some plants just to get the base level up. It doesn't tell me what the comfort level, I guess, it, it brings it up by. I want to try something else here. First, let's put the bed down and go to bed so that we don't lose any more sanity or get sleep deprived. Because I think they said something about that. Now we can finish her up with this stuff. I want to see about... Because there was something about an arch. Um, you. Is that just like a door kind of thing? If that's the case, I want to try and see like making a room here. So I'll need a uh, one, two, three. Starting to get really into the base building. That's how you know I'm starting to like it a lot. And then... Yeah, that increased the comfort level. Okay. 
cool beans. Do that. Put the rug in your room. Also, move this. That clipped through, which is weird. Alright, so the other thing we have to do is... I think I had a storage chest? Yeah. Put this also in your... Room. Place this storage chest with all of the food bits... Outside next to your fire because that makes the sense consumables transfer everything okay I feel better made me think I was drinking it for a second transfer We're going to gut this fish. Storage. Place everything. Okay, so now... Take the cooked meal. We need to... One, drink some of that water. Eat some of these berries. Perfect. Light the fire for a second. Also cook more stuff. Make a bunch of these. So this will also jump up our cooking level. stuff. No. This is why I think I want to have everything inside. I don't have to keep running around. side too then? I mean, yeah. Definitely can. Should you though? Because it usually means like everything's like panning and smelling inside your inside your base or next to where you sleep. Anvil. Leather strips, that's what's preventing me. Um, 
I don't need to make two of these. Wait. That's right. It just doesn't quick like that. Put these all away. I have no more scrap, which makes me sad. Wait. Can I? It's probably something I have to unlock. Maybe from that new zone, which I still have to research. Four rocks. So now, what is a glade? Oh, it's a unique piece. Okay. Has to be part of the forest. Okay. Also, we need to sleep soon. Not bad. We redesigned the entire base. We put a new... chest outside for all the food that I didn't realize I was carrying like that. Let me see. The equipment's fine. Actually, I should deposit some of these arrows. I don't think I have enough room for this. Transfer stack. Transfer stack. That's it. That is it. All this miscellaneous stuff. That's fine. Miscellaneous stuff. So the store, the bookshelf is just for show. Okay. I'm a prolific hoarder, also. Can we do anything with the brimstone? No. Smith. So I need five more rotten teeth to get to level two. Everything else on here I know and I've built already. Except for this. A trap which to catch things both wild and lost. Oh. Okay. I was just about to go outside and get some beeswax, but... Rest. I feel like one thing I do before we go to the Glade is going to be this. Swap these. So I'm going to do that every time, try to run into this wall. If I do get enough pieces, I'm going to put a chest here for all of my... Uh, Smelting stuff. I don't know where to get tech scrap, though. Let's drink and eat. So we're going to the glade now. Things I think that we need. Probably... I don't know. Maybe we have a 30 stack of berries. We could always get more bees. Always could get more bees. What's the prerequisite for making those bees things? Is it the bees wax? Because if it is, I don't even need to go farming out here for that. I do need more meat, though. Skin and gut. Oh, I have level three now. Chop this. So is that right there just the Oh, 
about what? I see you wiggling. Come on closer. Are you just bugged? I think it was just bugged. Bones? Look, can I just come over here to farm bones now instead of having to go crazy every time I kill a, a lost soul? I think that's what it's a greed crave inscription. Here in the forest, dark and deep, I offer you eternal sleep. Why am I poisoned? Did that happen because I read this? Yeah, every time I'm reading that, it's adding to it. Stop doing that. <laughs> Stop doing that, you fool. Uh, yeah, you're 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 something something else there. We're gonna die. Ah. Okay, what's the map look like? Ah. Edit world. Nope, not edit world. Make the new piece. Wait, what? Yep, this. I think we'll be fine with this poison. Where's old lumberjack up there? I do love that the deer runs for about five seconds and then stops. Not even five seconds, just runs, stops. It's like, I'm, I'm in the clear. Gets belted over the head with my axe. Ah. All right, so the snakes didn't poison me, but reading the grave ah. did. Hey, I've got your uh, skull. You found one. Great job. Excuse me for a second. I'm going to make something special out of this. Please have this axe as a small thank you. This will take some time. Would you give me an axe? Lumberjack's axe. This is doing 15 damage. This is doing 13 damage. Yeah, no, I'm good. Hunting gear? Some hunting gear you're looking at. Already have guessed it, but I'm a passionate hunter. You seem to be interested in hunting. I'd love to learn. I don't have any gear. This gear is mine, and I need it myself, so you'll have to get your own bow. But I would love to help. Here's Hunter's Code. Somebody with your crafting skills should be able to make a bow. I have some tendon drying on my porch that you could use as a bowstring. Alright, we're no longer poisoned. Uh, okay, so now world peace is researchable. Bowstring, let's go. What bow, what, what world piece did I just pick up? Also, I can't believe I did that. I read the thing three times. I'm like, what is this? Why is it making that noise? Oh yeah, I'm dying now. Um, I could probably eat the fish skewers. To not be completely dead. What's this? Animal wa animal watering hole in the forest. Really likes this forest zone. Maybe I'll make one of those things where I edit the world. And put uh, 
something like here. I need two inks. How did I make ink? I forget. Berries and something. What was it? It was probably huckleberries and... I don't remember. I made it early on for something. The rabbits ever leave the forest? Can I chase them out of the forest? Yes. Confirmed. Dodge rolling does not make you any faster. Okay. How do I make ink? I need two. That's the fletching table, buddy. Oh yeah, fletching table. We can make a bow now. Uh, I need one branch. Thank you. It wouldn't. It wouldn't toggle for a second. Craft. I have a bow. I'm gonna put you at three. Uh, that's there. I'm gonna. Put the hammer at nine. Put the shovel at eight. No, put the map at eight. Put the shovel at seven, because I don't know what it's used for. Recipe book there. Put the this as five. I guess I'll put you as four. See what happens with that. Good, good, good. So now I have a bow. And we need to research that new piece. Rocks. I really like rocks. Okay, and then I need to research ink. One feather and four huckleberries. Do I even have any feathers? I have literally one to make. Ugh. I gotta go shake some trees. Give me a feather. Please? I wonder if editing the world costs me a tile. They're all outside. This is why craft from storage is the best. Okay. Uh, make two of you. Now let's look at the map real quick. I wanted to change this one. So it does eat up your your free one. Okay. I mean, I thought it would. I just was verifying, I guess. But yeah. Alrighty. What a day. What a bunch of days in here. But uh, yeah, that's going to do it for this episode of Let's Play Above Snakes. Uh, if you like the video, drop a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed to the channel. Ring the notification bell. Uh, you can leave comments, share the videos, and share the channel. Those are the best ways to support what I'm doing, and I really do appreciate it. But until next time, take care, have a good one, and I'll see you soon.